welcome to another Axis Accountants Zero tip. This time we're going to look at adding a PayPal account to your Zero setup. A lot of people I know trade uh, through PayPal and use them to make payments and receive money from customers, and so have, having that automatically fed into Zero is a massive time saver. This can be a little bit tricky, so if you need help, then I suggest you contact your Zero advisor. Um, but if you follow these steps then it's completely doable. The first thing you want to do is actually add an account. Now you can do that through the chart of accounts or you can do that through accounts and bank accounts and you click on add a PayPal account. It's going to ask you for a name, call that something like PayPal account and then I would tick this button to set up automatic PayPal import. Now it says automatic import, but there are some steps you're going to need to follow um, in order to get um, PayPal working how you need it to work. You're going to have to log on to PayPal and do um, a bit of change some settings on PayPal. So the first thing you want to do is add in your email address, and this is the email address that you would sign on to PayPal. And what Zero is going to do is going to email you for confirmation that that is actually your uh, email address and that it is linked to PayPal and then what you can do down here is set a date so you can specify the start date of the transactions so that's great if you've got open imbalances and you don't want anything brought in before then and we click save. You can see now that you've got a PayPal account here and with the information that you've just entered Zero are going to email you a activation email so if we just go and find that and there it is and then Xero also give you some very easy to follow instructions that I'm going to go through with you this gives you a very good list of instructions and things to follow so log into PayPal and locate the my sell install link now it does say here that the location changes depending on the type of PayPal account you have now that's important because you get a lot of queries from people who are trying to do this and they click on PayPal and they just can't see any any reference to my selling tools. So there's a bit of, a bit of information there. For business account holders, uh, the profile is on the paid my uh, on the home page and you click on my selling tools. And I'm going to show you what that looks like. So from the home page, click on your profile and my selling preferences. Under this we're looking for this heading here, my a, uh, the API access configure how my website communicates with PayPal so we click on that and referring back to the instructions in the option one box select the grant API permission so we want to do that and then these two headings are important so we'll keep an eye on them we'll come back to them in a second so we want to add or edit API permissions and you see there I've always already done that but what you would need to do is click on add a new third party and then just copy this piece of text here, copy and paste that in there. Look up zero and that's warning me that I've already got that so I can't, can't do that but I'm going to click edit because that's this is where it will bring you and then what we're looking for on this big list here are these two, obtain information about a single transaction and then search your transaction for items that match specific criteria you can see there that zero have highlighted them. Then all you need to do is click save, close down PayPal and go back to your zero. And that's it. What will happen now, um, and it won't happen straight away, but it will happen overnight, is PayPal and zero will communicate and it will load in the transactions from the date that you've selected. If you go back to your dashboard, you'll now have a PayPal account and that will be there. The key thing to remember about the PayPal account is, as far as Xero is concerned, it is a bank account and it as such needs to be reconciled. So that was another Xero tip from Axis Accountants. We are the Xero experts, so if you need um, any Xero advice, then visit our website www.axisltd.co.uk or call us. Thank you.